Okay, folks, let's keep going on this. Uh, scared myself. Where they are, but where they don't belong. Ooh, doo, doo, doo. stuff is pretty neat to work with because it just all you gotta do is keep it moist and it seems to be pliable now how much of my finger marks should I try to erase eh it's always like, I leave a lot of little old bung, bung, bungs and scratch marks and uh, some of that don't look good. That's the dragon. Oh, there it is. Comes out up here, eh? Almost thought that was the flame. Hmm. I did for a second. Yeah, we'll fix that. It's not the flame. There's the flame.
Oops, there goes another fingernail nick. Ah. I do a lot of those. I should leave them in there and that'd be my signature marks. Signature screw up marks. Oops, like right there. On the inside. Oops, see. And a little piece of clay can go right in that. Stretch mark spot there. All right, is that flame? Yep. Well, there's that bad spot on my thumb. Makes a print right there. It's an old machete cut. When it gets moist it starts opening up and leaves a mark got that cut when I was hunting oil nothing to do with firing the kiln I haven't been hurt much at all firing pots been hurt more working on the jobs working for other people Or trying to find work. I broke my back one time looking for a job on a bicycle. How about that? Almost broke my neck. Going over the handlebars. I guess it's a good thing I just caught myself on. Huh? Handstand. Caught myself with my hands, but it didn't work too good. I still jammed my neck, my back, compression fracture. Didn't even know it either. It's too poor to find out. Hell, I was just in pain. I thought I wanted drugs, that's all. I didn't know. Found out later when I had meningitis, they did an MRI. Yeah, compression fracture, boy. Well, I've been on no chain gang. Get some scales here somewhere. Whee! Oh, I see where we can go. Just suggest that drag in there. A little of the body. More flame.
get in here. All right, that's a little more defined. I remember making a mark like that somewhere in a piece of wood sculpture. <clears throat> How's our level? <laughs> Ooh, it's a little off. Uh... Still a bit off, but not as bad. <laughs> Don't have to be perfect, you know. It doesn't matter if it's really level. All the way. Well, that would be kind of cool. See if I could get it back to staying level. And yet, out around like all this. that in too, back in there for you. Let's take a break for a minute or two or an hour. We're a little further along. Scales are going to go there.
changes there are gonna be shadows. Boy, this stuff really works on shadows. And really no telling where the fire is gonna go. How's that fire gonna whip around on here? Jabbed it again there. The fingernail mark. I wonder, where's my bucket of uh, throwing water, throwing slurry? be the last one for a while. Unless I find a way to if I find a way to bisque them somebody with a wood burning kiln next year to find a place to work sure be nice to find one of them gals that lady said is looking for me <laughs> I should go on that bachelor show eh Toothless Potter tried to date one of them youngins. I had a teacher one time pulled it off for a little while till he got fired. some of that what you call tearing the clay on the dragon itself a little bit because I like that texture like the ground being pushed up and stretching. Uh-oh. 
sounds like the rock and roll ghosts are at the door. Must be the midnight hour. <laughs> Whether our love should come tumbling down, shouldn't be wasting time on this muse. I should have the love muse going on. Love you two times, girl. Love you three times. Love you all night long. Love you two times. Three times. Five times. Twenty times. Love you all night long. Remember when we could love us? Love each other two or three times a day. Well, okay. I want to take a break. <laughs> Is it 420? Oh, it's only midnight. <laughs>